Hey guys, so I'm going to basically be doing this interview with Keisha because I don't have a Gundam, but I, um, my brother was a little upset that I didn't do enough videos of Keisha, you know, because he's going off to college, he kind of wants to see a few of them if he wants to. This is one that he can just look at, so we're just going to be filming Keisha for that purpose. But I wanted to do a review of Gundam Wing. Why? Well, it's a very good show in my opinion. The animation is... Uh, good for the uh, time period, but we'll get into that. Um, let's start out with what Gundam uh, Wing is. Gundam Wing, for those of you who do not know, is an anime uh, uh, mecha, and it basically uh, follows um, this group of, I guess you want to, space colony uh, rebels. Uh, they basically fight against the Earth forces. Uh, for uh, lunar independence, if you want to call it that, from what I remember. Um, now, Gundam, Gundam in general, is a huge industry in the mecha. I mean, it like defines mecha uh, to a large extent because they have so many different offshoots. It deals with so many different storylines. There's like Unicorn. There's, there's just tons and tons and tons. Uh, but Gundam Wing is probably one of the better known and probably one of the better series overall in my opinion. Now, why do I say that it's better known? Well, it aired on Cartoon Network um, for a while and that's that's a huge help. Um, also, overall I think the plot was a little bit stronger than a couple later series. I mean, you know, there's so many Gundams, it's kind of like Final Fantasy. There's always one you can find one that you like and you can find it one that you absolutely loathe just because there's so much. Um, what else about Gundam Wing? Um, I think one interesting factor uh, when you deal with Gundams in general is that to a large extent it deals with technology um, and military advancing advancements um, in an interesting fashion. Where are you going? Um, you know, it, it really shows how important they are. Um, and beyond that, Gundam's, uh, the entire series of, uh, has very compelling story, has a very compelling storyline, especially once again with the main character who I'll allow you guys to figure out his name because it, it I've heard it pronounced differently, which is strange. I know it's kind of a straightforward name. Um, what else about Gundam Wing? Um, to a certain extent, it's 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 an injustice not to do a complete review, like go into like thirty minute periods and just show dog faces. <laughs> Understand? I'll probably get some hate comments because I'm just I I should have printed off some Gundam Wing stuff, but I don't know. I d in a certain extent, I don't want to go any deeper into it because. Um, I don't want to make this video extra long, and beyond that, once you get into Gundam Wing, the actual plot, it gets, it, you end up having to talk about it for so long just to explain it, because it's such a good, you know, plot, each character's backstory is interesting, um, so I don't really want to go that much in depth, I'm just going to say real quickly, the animation for the time period when it was made is pretty good, and no, you don't get to be in this video. Oh, you scared the other one away. You're nothing but a troublemaker. Anyway, um, yeah, the animations, I guess they left, I guess it should be time for me in this video. Uh, the animation's pretty good, and um, once again, memorable characters, and beyond all that, the um, aspects of uh, technology are interesting. So if you're into Mecha or you've heard of Mecha, you've probably already seen the series. But if you haven't, uh, it is definitely worth a look. If you're not into Mecha, this is one of those few Mecha that I would recommend for even people that are not into Mecha. Because it's worth a try. It's not, it's not as corny as other series. Uh, even in Gundam. You know, it actually is... Uh, it actually is probably the best Gundam series, in my opinion. It's a reason. It's one of the most recognizable, um, and uh, I once again I cannot say anything better about it. If I was going to give a recommendation uh, for Mecha, this one would be it. So, having said that, I would give it 
four and a half out of five. Uh, definitely. Uh, the now dealing with the sub and the dub, um, there's some disagreements over the characters, but I would generally say that their dub is good enough for me. It's not great. It's not amazing. It's not, you know, oh my goodness, oh thank God they have this dub, but it's good enough. <laughs> so uh, having said that, oh the fight sequences are also um, yeah, there's be Gundam's fight sequences later on that are better, but um, these ones are pretty good. Anyway, that's it. Have a great day. Comment, uh, rate, subscribe. You know the drill. Have a great day. Bye.